Oh my god, Andy, I am so sorry. This is your 400th video you have edited for me. How you feeling? Yeah, that seems like a, a reasonably safe expression to have. You... <laughs> Somebody call a doctor. Well, have you considered that maybe the unstoppable force is in love with the immovable object? Maybe the reason one refuses to stop and the other refuses to move is because they both long for the collision. Oh. My least rational fear is what if I end up being a pony in the MLB universe? <laughs> okay. And I get the most revealing cutie mark, like, what if my cutie mark is the bisexual flag, and I have to cover it up with makeup for years and pretend to be a blank flag to not get outed to my conservative Pegasus father, who's... <laughs> God. Whose favorite newspaper is called The Right Wing. Uh... Hmm, sounds like... Bing. When you're unsuccessfully looking for something and start gradually increasing your it could be there range. Like, yeah, sure, maybe the rice cooker pot is in the freezer. Oh no. Limbs be left hard draw, please. Posts without tags? Adding tags to your post helps people find them. Why would I tag my suffering? Can anyone tell me why I enter the grocery store a normal person and emerge as some sort of vile, ravening monster? It's the prices. Overstimulation fluorescent lighting. You are all correct. You random nobody! Me to a newborn baby. While looking up 1950s slang, I found the phrase, come on, snake, let's rattle, which has two meetings, asking someone to a dance and challenging someone to a fight. And oh boy, does that fact have some potential. Aren't you tired of being nice? No, I'm tired of everyone else being mean. I want to go apes. I just want to hug. Hey, have you ever thought about entering into a cat show? With this? Well, <laughs> he'd probably at least get a participation ribbon. The primordial soup hypothesis. Mmm, learning about fun new things in bio. Collect my soups. The Met Office warns the UK will be double fisted by deadly snow and ice. Needless to say, this isn't a term we would use to describe the weather. <sighs> if this post gets 3k notes by March 15th, like two months, I'll dye my hair a new color, get new clothes, stay clean from SH for two weeks, get a new piercing, and actually make an OC. I know I ain't getting 3k notes, so good luck, Lamau. Well, time to Mr. Beast this shit. Oh, there's a witch in these woods? Is she single? I'm gonna be right back, gonna ask the force which out on a date. My firstborn child has been stolen. Your wife taking care of your child is not stealing. No, you live in a society. I live in my meticulously crafted daydream universe that I've been using as a coping mechanism since childhood. And you will not take that away from me. It's important to read to your kids, but not too much, lest they start saying words like, perchance and undoubtedly. And then you run, run as far away as you can. God, America kind of dropped off these last couple hundred years. They used to call it the Wild West. Now it's just the Midwest. <laughs> That's good. That's good. I like that one. This is my unethical polycule. The non-monogamy is consensual and negotiated. We're just evil in other ways. Like, for example, I just took the letter N out of the alphabet. How do you feel about that now, Editor A.D.? <laughs> Honestly, Pokemon is the ideal universe, not just because there's cute animals that are your life companions, but because they have walkable cities and adequate biking infrastructure. Now, hold on a second. My only problem with the Pokemon universe is, like, a country's, like, I don't know, like, nine towns? How does it work? Maine, do not deliver DoorDash to a gnome. I got lost in the whimsical forest for 27 fucking days, solving musical riddles and matching colored mushrooms and shit, and I didn't even get a tip. Oh, sorry I didn't tip you, but the Guardian Frog's riddles are not that hard, and my blueberry plum swirl ice cream was completely melted after you spent, oh, I don't know, 27 days failing to think of a lily pad? Which is literally always the answer to the musical riddles. Uh, how dare you? How dare you? Zero stars. I love when my cat meows at me and I can see her little teeth because she looks just like this. Oh my god. How did you get these two pictures of cats? 
British people losing their accents when they sing proves that they just use it for attention. As a British that can sing can confirm my accent just completely changes to something else entirely. I don't know how it happens, it's witchcraft, I swear! Well, you know what, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave this microphone here and I'm gonna go, Andy. You, whatever happens, happens. You don't... You don't gotta do a thing, you just do your stuff. I'm gonna go, I got places to move to, things to see. Love you, don't thanks for 400 episodes. Okay, all right, I gotta go.